Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel, Mama Two Boys. Um, it's been a minute, I know. Um, I've just had like family um, member in the hospital and we've had a couple of surgeries and uh, those of you that know, thank you for your prayers. I really appreciate it. And uh, yes, so everything is going good. And um, I had a moment today and went to the hospital, left, did a little retail therapy. I had to go... I just stopped at a few places, um, Michael's, Target, and the Dollar Tree, and um, I kind of want to keep this under 10 minutes, so I'm going to kind of go fast, um, and uh, I do want to say I have mail from some of you guys, and I really appreciate it. I will try my best to get that up Friday, and uh, I will get it up Friday, whatever it takes. I'm going to try and get it up Friday, but Lisa Rose, I received from you. Um, I have all your mail, everyone's mail here. I think Jackie, I told you I have yours. Um, so yes, if you've sent me something and wondered if I've got it, it's here in my little designated mail basket that I've been putting things in. And I've just missed you guys and uh, family comes first and we all you know, feel that way and I hope you understand. And welcome to everybody that I've seen coming in and um, joining the little family here. I appreciate your support and uh, just welcome aboard. I've got a little stage fright. I haven't filmed in like over a week. So uh, I normally do at least twice a week and um, it's been over a week without a video from me. So anyways, I want to keep it really short and my video cut off the last time and I didn't get to show the DIY. This is the Dollar Tree DIY um, and it's just the succulents, the rocks, and I've got quite a bit of succulents in here, but, and I'm, I'm setting this on my back patio on a table, and a lot of people have thought it was real that have seen it, and, um, but yeah, two bags of rocks, the tin, and then like, what, one, two, three, four, five, six, five succulents, so yeah, less than 10 bucks, and voila, I like how it turned out. Anyway, that was my DIY I was wanting to show y'all. So, Let's go ahead and get started with the haul. And um, first, I'm going to start with Target. Yes. Is this Target? No. This is at Michael's. <laughs> I have it all, like, spaced out here. Um, this was wrapped up. I went ahead and unwrapped it. But we have a family member staying with us. Um, and she is going to be leaving us in a couple of days. And I'm going to send her off with this little mug because she loves smiley faces and yellow and, um, yeah, I just seen this and it had her name written all over it. So, gonna give her that. And the little dollar fifty section, I did pick up two of these trim borders and they're pink and white and they're both a little different there. Yeah, but thought they were cute and I love pink and you know I had to grab it. I grabbed this. These are the two like burlap bags. Not really burlap. I don't know what they're calling it. Um, but anyways, it says food for thought. Let's turn around this way. Food for thought, and it's got the mason jar, and um, so I thought they were cute. You get two in there for $1.50, and then these little tags here um, I thought were really cute. They're like metal, I call them metal pieces, but they they have like the twine on there, and I just thought it was cute. It's that time of year. We're all in our gardens and flower beds, and here's the watering can, the spade, the pail, and the rake right there. I just thought it was too cute, so pick that up and here is a note pad it says nourishing notes and it's got that food for thought right here in the mason jar and this was a dollar fifty and it has the um, magnet on the back um, I have picked up these tags with the Baker's twine and it's got that corrugated type uh, right here and it says made with love and you get um, five tags in two yards of twine so I thought that was really cute and good for a dollar fifty. So that was all for Michaels, and I went on and got my youngest, bless his heart, with everything going on. He's like, Mom, I'm out of deodorants, blah blah blah, blah. and I just keep forgetting. He's been using his dad's backup that he has in there, but I went to Target to get those to pick up his favorite, his deodorant and his body spray. Nothing fancy there. Um, in the dollar spot, I picked up one of the the other day. I hauled. Well, it's been. It's been a while back, but I hauled the ceramic mug, and it was um, gray or the mint green, but it had like the gray arrows on it, and then I seen this one and had to have it because it's the baby pink, white, and the gold um, polka dots there, 
So, um, and that was $3. So it's not a bad buy because this is ceramic, you know, for three bucks. Um, picked up these pencils and not, a, I didn't get a whole lot. This is all I got in the dollar spot were these two items. Um, and it's just these pencils and I just love these pretty little patterns that they have, the little floral, uh, patterns. And they actually kind of match some of the, um, uh, dividers that I had picked up a while back. And I went ahead and took this out, but I did find the e.l.f. contouring brush. And see how thin it is? Perfect contour. And I've been hunting one of these, and um, I finally found one. So picked up that. And this was, I believe, six bucks. In e.l.f., I also picked up a daily face cleanser. This is new. New to me. It says new, anyways. And I do have a skin nutrition's um, face wash that I've been using, and I love that. But I wanted to give this one a try. And it is daily face cleanser with purified water. So um, it's no parabens, no sulfates, and no, well, I don't know, whatever that word is. But uh, yeah, pick that up. And I believe this was $5. And I also just picked up this um, for someone. I'm going to be bringing it to her this evening. She wants her eyebrows done. Um, so... It's just, just an eyebrow pencil, and it's CoverGirl True Naked, and you've got your dual ends, your ebony, and your mocha. So, it says eyeliner, but you can use it for, uh, you can use it for eyebrows, so. Sorry, I'm drinking my cold coffee, y'all. I'm tired. I don't have much sleep, so <laughs> kind of tired. Okay, um, I feel like I'm off my game. I haven't put a video up in a while, so just bear with me, bear with me. I uh, picked up some placards, and um, these are repurchases. Uh, this is from Dollar Tree now. We're on the Dollar Tree. And this is a repurchase, and I like to get the one. They have many different kinds, but I like to get the one with a really fine point right there. Um, so, yeah, the one's for tight teeth, and got that. I picked up a couple of things for our grill um, from Cooking Concepts, and this is, a little thing came off there. It's a silicone basting brush, and I don't like using the mops, the like regular mops, because they're hard to clean, and um, yeah, so I just picked up this long um, silicone one, and then also from Cooking Concepts, I got the Grill Cleaning Stone, and that's what it looks like there, and it's pretty good size, so it, you know, I don't think we've used the stone, we've used like the grill brush and everything, so uh, yeah. I figured we would give that a try from Cooking Concepts. I'm off my game. I haven't recorded in a while. So, um, they had the Aleve and a six pack. And so I got two of them. So I can stock up uh, my little pill bottle in my purse. That, and it's gardening season. I haven't got my tomatoes yet, but pretty soon. I'm hoping to get them this weekend. But I bought these many places, and this is great for a dollar because you also get a huge refill right here. But it's just like a twist ties, and you pull as long as you want it, and it's got this thing where you cut it, and you just tie your plants up or whatever, whatever you need to use it for. You can use it for many things. This reminded me of some something like this my mom had when we were when I was growing up, and it's just the bacon rack. And um, I mean, I'm gonna give it a try for a buck. The one we had when we were kids, I think, was made out of something different, but uh, it was basically like this. So, I'm going to give that a try. I picked up some um, dog treats for the dogs and because um, they were running kind of low. And uh, I've tried these before, and they like them. And I try, I'm try, i trying these, and so hopefully they'll like these because these are all natural, and um, they're soft. My dogs don't like the hard uh, treats. So since they're soft, I'm hoping that, uh, they'll like them. So anyway, dog treats. One last thing. Well, two more things, this and something else. But anyways, I got this and this is like, it's not like your normal microfiber cloth. It's like really fuzzy and it's called a super soft microfiber cloth. And, um, for keeping, you know, I like to keep my truck all shiny and stuff when I wash it and everything. So it just, it feels like it's worth so much more than a dollar. So uh, maybe I should have got two. I don't know, but I picked this up and uh, I'm not going to say I can't wait to use it because it's a job washing that big old truck. But uh, yeah, I'm hoping it works really good, but really soft. So 
Last but not least, um, I found these little babies. I'd already purchased the grapefruit scented in the pink little mason jar, and I've seen these, and I had to grab two of them, and it is the Jasmine Lavender Hand Wash Gel in, with essential oils, and um, so yeah, I picked up two of those, and I've already smelled them, and they smell really good. So yes, that is my haul, and I'm hoping that this will upload everything, so I need to like hurry up and get off of here and um thank y'all for tuning in and thank you for watching and i hope to get back on here friday for um a mail day and um thank you all so much uh you know who you are um you just make me feel special and um yes i just love you all i've missed you and uh thanks for tuning in so until next time we will talk to you later guys bye